What's going on everybody and welcome back to a brand new episode of Maximus the Fourth. What I have to present to you guys today is Mountain Dew Baja Blast. Now this is a review that is very uh, definitely due and for those of you that do not know Mountain Dew Baja Blast is actually going to become a permanent item on store shelves. Let's look into the history of Mountain Dew Baja Blast. As usual, I'll give you the history lesson, and then I'll open this thing up, give you guys a taste test, rate it on a scale of 1 through 10, letting you know exactly what I think about it, and then that'll be it here. So here we go. Mountain Dew Baja Blast is a Mexican-inspired tropical lime flavor of Mountain Dew, and is a green like teal in color. It's tropical theming ocean like teal in color. It's tropical theming is shared with its Baja family. While it was once paired with former secondary Taco Bell exclusive Sangrita Blast, Baja Blast was first released in August of 2004 exclusively at Taco Bell locations in the US. This was the very first time a beverage company and a fast food restaurant designed to taste with their Mexican inspired food. This was an instant hit and in 2014 eventually there was a limited retail release where you could buy this in cans or bottles. So in other words this was the very first time in history that any beverage company and restaurant or fast food joint had combined to work together to make an exclusive item. The drink has been reoccurring staples of Mountain Dew is retail lineup ever since, frequently releasing as part of their summer lineup, plus turning into a permanent flavor in January of 2024. Once this does officially happen, this will mark the second country to receive Baja Blast as a permanent flavor in which the first is Canada. So the question is, is will Mountain Dew Baja Blast actually become permanent for good? And if it does, will it really? But the question is, is, how long will it actually become permanent? And will it stay permanent? I don't know. You guys don't know either. You never know what PepsiCo is going to do. But that is the latest update of Mountain Dew Baja Blast. Let's open up this thing and try it out. This can is from a limited store release, which happened this year in the summer. Had a bunch of crap inside of that pour, I don't know why, but let's give this a taste. It says do with a blast of natural and artificial tropic tropical lime flavor. I can absolutely taste the lime in here. And it has so much more of a freshness to it and a sweetness and something that is so much more than just a lime, a tropical lime. I can't say that I've ever tasted a tropical lime in my entire life, but my goodness, if this is what a tropical lime would actually taste like, then this must be it right here in Mountain Dew Baja Blast. I personally always have been a pretty decent fan of Mountain Dew Baja Blast. I definitely know that there's people out there that like it a whole lot more than I do. But it's not a bad flavor, it's actually pretty good. Very refreshing, definitely tastes the lime, it's very sweet, 
and very good. The ingredients reads carbonated water, high fructose corn syrup, natural and artificial flavor, citric acid, sodium benzoate, which preserves the freshness, there's caffeine, gum arabic, sodium citrate, calcium to sodium EDTA, which is to protect the flavor, and sucrose acetate isobutrate. There's also yellow number five and blue number one as dyes. Sucrose is in this, huh? I don't know if you guys remember what sucrose is, but it is a natural sugar that comes from plants like fruits, vegetables, and nuts. The only other soda that I've ever seen that has sucrose or had sucrose was New Coke. That is overall pretty good though. Um, automatically, I, I would probably give this thing a 7.5 out of 10. But let's just taste it a little bit more and see exactly what we can figure out here. I sure do like the color. That's pretty nice. You guys might not be able to see the color that well because this is outside, but... And look at the artwork on that can, too. I really like that. So good. Very, very refreshing. Very refreshing. This 12 ounce can does have 170 calories, 55 milligrams of sodium, 44 grams of total carbohydrates, 44 grams of sugar. There are 88% of sugars that are added, and it is not a significant source of other nutrients. Very good. You can't go wrong with Mountain Dew Baja Blast. There's no way. I will leave this with an overall score of 8 out of 10. If you've never tried it, you gotta try some. And if you can't find some in stores, just go to any Taco Bell location and you should be able to find it. So stay tuned, you guys, because Mountain Dew Baja Blast should be coming as a permanent store item on retail shelves in 2024. Thank you for watching.